Let's talk hot dogs. I was just talking baseball yes. with my son, right? Perfect segue. Um, let's talk about, you know, we just need a little apple pie, right? right. Um, here we have, from the Kansas City Steak Company, these incredible hot dogs. It's no secret what the Kansas City Steak Company has done to steak burgers. Right. They took the same idea, steak trimmings, and put them into a hot dog. Right. You know, we've, we've all heard of all beef hot dogs, which right. these are. Yes. But these are actually all steak hot dogs. All steak steak dogs. Right. Because, you know, we talk about our burgers, and we have filet mignon and sirloin and mm -hmm. porterhouse and all the great cuts of our steaks, that western Kansas beef. Well, we reserve some of that, and we put it into um, you know, our special recipe and what makes a hot dog a hot dog. And we made these amazing hot dogs. They are incredible. Awesome. Like no other hot dog. They are huge. 3.2 ounces. These hot dogs are ginormous. Um, these like are the ones, you, the ones you wish they sold at the ballpark. <coughs> but guess what? You can grill them out in your backyard. You can heat them up when you're ready to eat them. We have two different size packs for you. You can get a dozen of them or you can get two dozen of them. The buy more and save is $19, meaning that if you were to buy two packs of 12 at $39.39, or sorry, $39.39 each, that would be more money than if you were just to go ahead and buy what we're giving you in that 24 pack. It's $19 less. Right. The easy pay on this is phenomenal. They come all frozen, yeah. right? And then what do I do? Just thaw them and grill them like I do any other hot dog? Thaw them and grill them. Yeah, just like any other hot dog. Whether you want to do it in your outdoor grill, your George Foreman, if you want to put them on a hot skillet or a cast iron skillet and get them nice and, you know, kind of charred on the mm. outside and, you know, juicy and flavorful. Remember, this is not just any hot dog. When you try this for the first time, you just see. When I first demonstrated, when I cut into this, try this next to your store bought hot dog. See if it looks anything remotely like that. I do this with our hot dogs. I kind of press down and show all the beautiful mm. natural juices of that steak coming out. Same thing with this. Remember, filet mignon, porterhouse, sirloin. Great cuts of those steaks are in this hot dog. That's what gives it that great flavor, that amazing texture, and like no other hot dog. Now, in one second, I'm gonna show you the hot dogs that we all grew up on, the hot dogs that many of us still eat, and the ones you kind of get in the ballpark. Mm -hmm. well, there's a place for those, but I'll tell you, if you're looking to serve the best hot dog you ever had, this is the one to go for. Well, I know our customers have really been great on the reviews for when we've put together steak and hot dog right. combos and burger and hot dogs, but what we found is so many of you said, I just want the hot dogs. Can, I, yeah. can you just give me the hot dog? So that's why we put together this offer, perfect time of year, what's quick and easy to throw on the grill where you don't have to tend to it for too long, you don't need to cook it too long, and everybody's gonna like it, delicious all beef hot dogs, which is what these are from the Kansas City State Company. Right, and now Jill, here they are. This is how big they are, okay? I'm, I'm a decent sized guy, and just put it in perspective how big these are, four to a pack. That's all you're gonna get in there is four to a pack. That fills the whole pack. Now. Here's those hot dogs that I was talking about. Wow. Take a look at that. Now, the first thing you're going to notice, what's the first thing you notice? Color. Color. Look at this. That's the color of beef. Mm -hmm. This is this beige color is not necessarily yes. the color of beef. And I took a couple of these out of the package. But look, this is really the size. And all kidding aside, you know, we all heard about the, the mystery dogs growing up mm -hmm. or whatever. But it's, all, it's never really been more important to really know what you're feeding your family, know what you're eating. Remember, this is an all beef hot dog, Western Kansas corn fed beef. This one right here. This has probably got additives and fillers and different meats going on there. Even though it might be all beef, it doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be all beef, not all created equally. Right. But that's the great part about it there. But the bun fillers, I mean, look yeah. at this. This literally, this is a big, one of the biggest buns I could f uh, find. It and fills that it. bun and then some. It Isn't doesn't shrink up. It's got that great punch of oh, flavor. Nothing better than a hot dog. It really isn't. Right? I mean, just nice to have in your arsenal. You'll put those packs in the freezer pull them out, you know, they can thaw out in no time, run them underneath some cool water, they'll thaw out, throw them on the grill. Your meat arsenal, I like that. Right? Yeah, you, know, you got your burgers, you, <laughs> you got your steaks, out, you got your hot dogs. You're good to go, it thaws out quickly, you're cooking it up, you're eating in no time. Kids love them, you know, if you're entertaining, you're having a pool party, you want to do a mix of all different kinds of foods. And frankly, like, I almost look at these and think, gosh, couldn't you cook up a whole bunch of them, slice them up and put little um, yeah. uh, toothpicks little in them? Germs. And they're like little hors d'oeuvre bite sizes with a whole bunch of different sauces. No doubt about it. You could do it. like hot dog dippers. Yeah. How easy is that? For sure. <laughs> you know, again, why don't we have this shot on here, too? You know, I can't overestimate how great these are as far as comparable to the hot dogs that you get. I mean, this is, you can just see all those natural juices. That is the steak flavor coming right out. Remember, we talk about how well marbled our steaks are. Yeah. They're marbled because all that's that juices and the flavors that come in. Well, those trimmings going in is what causes those, those hot dogs to be incredibly juicy and all that great flavor. So, you know, whether you want to fill your bun, 
and kind of, I've got lots of great toppings over here. So if anybody wow. wants to shoot in here and oh. share, and if you want to try a burger, or, right. I'm sorry, a hot dog, if you like any of your favorite toppings. I didn't know he was offering it up Oh, here. I am offering it up. What's, right. Hey, what's okay. your, here, what's your deal? One. What do you like? What do I, truly? Yeah. You, Plain. You straight up? <laughs> okay. Well, I don't My know. whole life. Well, you've already no catchy, you've committed yourself. No musty, no mayo, no, <laughs> no relish. I don't want any of it. I just like it plain. Thank you. And Jill, you'll notice you get a snap. As soon as you bite into it, you get texture. Mm -hmm. You get a snap from the outside. And then just the inside is just a punch, a really punch of robust flavor. Nothing better than a good hot dog. You know, this is delicious. It's not greasy. Right. And you also listen to our customers on the recipe. You know what we yeah. do? So for good. the last couple of years, we brought our hot dogs here. They've been hugely popular. Everyone loved mm. the flavor. And the only comments that we got was some people had just said, you know, we love the flavor, but maybe bring the salt level down, just, just mm -hmm. a hint. So, you know, we did that. So these hot dogs right here and going forward, we brought that, that sodium level down, but we really worked hard to make sure good. that we maintained all of that flavor that we loved so much about the Kansas City State Company hot dog. And I think we hit it right on the mark. I think everybody here in this entire building has tried these and they all love them. Mm. So I think you're gonna love them as well. Delicious, delicious flavor. And like I said, not spicy, no. but some people are like, ooh, is that gonna be too spicy? No spice, just good flavor. Not salty, just good flavor. Not greasy, just good flavor. And that's because, again, you're not using this recipe of, I'm not quite sure what meat they're putting in those hot dogs, but you're getting it from the Kansas City Steak Company where you know you're getting the trimmings from all those delicious steaks that so many of you love. Let's scoot to our phones. Okay. We're busy on the lines. Remember, we can send you a dozen dogs. That price is $39, but your real value is if you get the set of 24, that saves you $19. But I have to let you know the immediate shipment for the set of 24 is last call. So if that's something you really want to make sure you have for that 4th of July, Make sure that you're dialing in and take advantage of that value. Gotta That's have what, the Fourth of July. What Kay did up in Maine. Hi, Kay. It's Jill and Greg. How are you? Hey, Kay. I'm great. How are you? Doing Hi, terrific. Greg. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So, tell us, have you ever tried these hot dogs before? And if not, why were you interested today? Oh my gosh, I absolutely love these hot dogs. I was so happy when they came on. I have about five or six still left in my freezer, but uh, I, I'm just I'm just ordering them because they're on and I don't want to be without. <laughs> right. <laughs> I know. We've had that over the years. We've mm -hmm. run out, so yeah. So describe the flavor, Kay. Why are these a better hot dog than maybe what you've tried from grocery stores or wherever? I, it's been so long since I've had a hot dog from a grocery store because I just can't buy them that way anymore. Okay. You've spoiled me big time. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was our objective. I'm glad we succeeded in that. You know what I do with them is I actually put them into my broiler underneath my in my oven Perfect. in the broiler on low and um, put them on low and let them broil and just keep turning them until they're done. Yeah. And they're frozen and they come and I just keep turning them and they're absolutely delicious. Absolutely Great. delicious. I love them. Oh, I'm so glad, Kay, and I'm glad you were watching today while we had this order so you'll be stocked up for summer. Yes, I will. Good. That's a great idea. Thanks, Kay. Thanks so much for Thanks. calling in. Thank you very much. I Alrighty. love that idea. That I like when the skin, that's why I like mine. I, if I put mine on kind the grill. Kind of blisters a well, little bit, if right? If I put mine on the grill, I like to leave mine on there probably longer than a lot of people. I like it kind of charred on the outside. Yes. But if I do mine in the skillet, exactly, it gets mm -hmm. blistery on there. And that's kind of the way I like it. And then love I get, that. I get that texture on the outside. And then when I bite in, it's that just juicy, wonderful punch of flavor inside. I can remember as a kid specifically asking my mom, could you just make me a burnt hot dog? Because I did love, <laughs> yeah, what I no. meant was, I like that kind of blistering. I like that That's kind good. of charred um, outer. Here's where we are with what we have available, everybody. Almost 1,200 of these have been ordered. In the immediate ship week, um, in the choice of 24, that has now sold out. But I can still ship out the 12, but only 200 left. Okay. And then the ship week after that is June 29th. So two weeks, um, but we and those will arrive in time for your Fourth of July cookout because yeah. Fourth of July is on a Saturday. Either way, you're getting it on Fourth so, of July. So yeah, so if you you know if you're freaking out, don't. We can still have you order that week of June 29th. You'll have it for Fourth of July. Same price, same buy more and save, which is fantastic. For folks just getting home from the office, Greg, yep. tuning in, they're seeing us talk hot dogs. What's the Kansas City difference here? We're talking about steak dogs here. We're talking about Western Kansas corn-fed 
filet mignon, porterhouse, and sirloin going into making these amazing hot dogs. Hot dogs like you've never had before. They've got the texture, they that rich flavor that you've never seen before mm. because it has, it's made from that Western Kansas beef and that's what makes them so special. We've had them here for a couple of years, barely been able to keep them in stock. Yeah. And now this year, remember, we reconfigured the recipe a little bit. We've kept all that great flavor, all the ingredients. We lowered the sodium level down. We're listening to the QBC yeah. families. And that was an amazing thing. That's a good thing. thing. It is. We There's always, nothing wrong with that. That remember, is a good thing. I mean, Jill, you've been here almost the whole time for, that we've been here, 20 years. Yes. We always listen to the QVC families. That's what we build our business on here, and that's who we're providing these, qual these quality products for. So if you have any comments, please make sure that you give them to us, and we'll, li we'll listen to them. Let's show everybody again how they come packaged, okay, if you, you don't it. mind, Greg. Okay. Remember, guys, we're going to show both, because we always like to show the ones that you're going to get and the ones that you usually do get. You get these nice, beautiful, beef-colored hot dogs because that's all they're made from, that Western Kansas beef. You know, remember, here's those Starbot hot dogs, those kind of tan, beige hot dogs. And also take, well, take a look, eight hot dogs in this pack to equal almost exactly what's in the same pack when wow. ours are four. four. They're huge, they're 3.2 ounces each. They're gonna fill the bun, Fill your stomach. I mean, they're they are definitely a meal within themselves. Can I do these on my George Foreman grill? You can do them, George Foreman. <laughs> In about fry thirty them, seconds, them. right? Yeah, you can do them <laughs> perfectly on your outdoor grill. If you, I know Sharon doesn't like people when they boil them. She always says yeah, that, but that's no okay. If you want to boil dogs. them or microwave them, it's not. You know, have a bit, discussion. The hot with dog my police will not come and oh, do that. No, so I have to. boiled what? hot dogs and sauerkraut. Oh, he I loves it. He well, loves put it. these in your baked beans in the fall yes, or something like that. That's good a good idea. Way to, they really. They have such a great flavor. Even if you do put them in your bake, I mean, they will really enhance the flavor. Unlike some of those kind of you know, lame hot dogs over there, they're yeah. just kind of giving some hot dogs and they're not adding anything. Let's go to the phones. Everything in the immediate ship is sold out. We're now into June 29th, everybody. You'll still have it 4th of July. Marianne in New Jersey, it's Jill and Greg. We're talking steak dogs. How are you? Hi, fine. How are you? We're great. Thank you. You getting ready for some summertime barbecue? Well, yeah, I, my daughter does the barbecuing. Okay. But, um, yeah, I've, I've ordered these hot dogs before, and you can't compare them to store hot dogs. Oh. <laughs> you really can't. They're excellent. Actually, They're just I can. so delicious. Yeah, I'm going to. But I've also had <laughs> your steak, burgers, or and your roast. Okay. And everything, oh, it's just fabulous for me. Thanks, Marianne. <laughs> oh, I'm glad. Well, hope you all enjoy cooking out and eating the hot dogs this summer, and thanks so much for calling in. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Bye, all right. You have a good summer. Okay. Thanks, thanks you Marianne. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. So, here's an update. We're busy on the phones, and we started with over 3,000 of our Kansas City hot dog configurations. June 29th is the only ship week we have available, and there's only 600 to go around in each. So that's 600 of the 12 count. Or remember, we can double that for you, but we don't double the price. You actually save $19 over if you had decided to double it. So it's a great value. Get that set of 24. When are you not going to want a hot dog? They're and always on hand. And you will get them for 4th of July in that second And you will have them for 4th of July. You will get them for 4th of July. M47095. Always good to see you. Thanks, Jill. Thanks for the dog. Bye, guys. Uh, we're going to talk popcorn coming up in just a moment. But I also want to remind you, we're going to take another look 